Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm, uh... I've got Liquid Truth Serum IPA by Dogfish Head. My lighting's not that great in here, but... Sun's starting to go down. Pretty cool. Just actually noticed they're swimming in a pool of, uh... Truth Serum there. So this is actually my, uh... 500th uh, untapped login so never had this before it's 7.0 alcohol by volume and 65 IBUs it is a year-round release and re was released in 2016 so nice looking golden beer with a little bit of carbonation, some nice lacing on the glass. I get uh, some nice tropical and citrusy notes on the aroma. They said there might be some piney notes too, but I don't get that on the aroma. Uh, I actually have my glasses. It says an IPA bursting with all the hops. One whole leaf, two liquefied, three pelletized, and four powdered. Okay. 16 ounces. Myth, IBUs. Jeez, I can't even read that with my glasses on. Uh, can only be achieved in the boil. Truth. Four different hop uh, additions added in the, in the whirlpool make this beer truthfully hoppy. Truthfully hoppy, without being deceitfully bitter. Okay, well, let's give it a shot and see. Okay, I definitely get the pine on the taste. It is uh, definitely fruity, definitely juicy. Uh, if I remember correctly at the store, this was canned in late August of 2018, so. And we're currently in October, so it's still good. I do get some malts. Slight malts, but... That dryness lingers. It's definitely resinous. But first, if you, when you take the, take the first sip... As soon as you uh, get it in the mouth, it, you can definitely taste the malt. Then it goes to the fruit. And then it gets pretty piney there at the end. And that dryness lingers after you swallow. Kind of hangs in there for a little bit. It's pretty good. Not going to ramble about it. Uh, again, some nice slicing here. Four out of five. I mean, out of five, I would give it a four out of five. And would I buy it again? Sure, absolutely. I don't remember what I paid for it. Uh, but again, Dogfish Head Liquid Truth Serum Indian Pale Ale. I'm having a hard time seeing here. I'm getting that sun glare behind me. Sorry about that. So, a pretty cool can. Pretty comical. So, I did see, I don't remember what it was called, but uh, the brewer of Dogfish Head had, had his own show for a while. On, like Discovery or something like this. It was a couple years back. It was pretty interesting. 
But anyway, everybody have a good night, and here's to my 500th login on Untapped. We'll see y'all. Have a good night.